Hey guys and welcome back to Adam Smasher, that is Landstrider's newest tech pack all about exploring the solar system and I have been joined by a friend today, not for voice but he's been coming along and helping a dig, you can see a decipher down there, he's helping me get moving on with all my equipment and stuff, just wanted to mention that you know I'm not doing this all on my own anymore, which is great. Now, you guys right remember last time we were like, hey, we're going to do a whole load of stuff. Oh, look. Oh, look. Oh, look. There's spawns over here. Oh, I was I was told this might be a thing. I, I don't have any way of protecting myself. That's something else we need to do. But if we have a look over here, we can see that there are a whole bunch of real nasty things. I don't see that one. There was a Dalek up on the up on the hill somewhere. Yeah, look, Dalek over there. Auton in the building. It's, uh, it's getting real. It's getting extreme. So we need to do some stuff about that. The first thing, of course, is to get myself a weapon. And I have a particular weapon in mind. I don't know how exactly to make it. I probably should have looked that up before doing this, but here we go. Let's run over towards my stash of stuff over this way. Have a look in the box. I think I need the string. Now, if I look inside here and go yo-yo, uh, I want a... Well, it's going to have to be an iron one, I think. Okay, so we need to make the cord, which is a bunch of string around the outside like that. A normal stick as well. Do I, do I carry a stick? Do I carry a stick? I don't. Let's uh, just grab a few wood because you know I'm going to need them when I get uh, into the real meat of today's episode. So we want one of those like that. We want to get a whole bunch of string around the outside for the cord. Cord in the middle. Great. Well, on the bottom there. Uh, bottom left. Throw in a whole bunch of iron and then stick in the middle. Brilliant. Iron yo-yo. Bam. Okay, now these things are great. These are these are melee weapons. Um, can't really do as many tricks with them in the game as I can in real life. But look, this we got this, this, uh, this, this thing that fires out and it stays out there for a very long time much longer than i can in real life and then you right click to bring it back that's pretty cool there okay another thing that we are definitely going to need for today's extravaganza is a piece of flint why do we need a piece of flint you know why so we can make ourselves a flint and steel and start thinking about getting inside the nether let's put the string back uh, i don't think i need this many wood planks you know what i'm going to just turn them into sticks and then that will be fun right i actually wanted more obsidian than this be sec be back in a sec There he is. Look, right, there we go. Set of shears for him because he does not have a bed, which is a bit of, bit of a shame, bit of a shame. Thankfully, I have a whole bunch of sheep over here. Uh, no problem. Also, should point out, look, more than just us two on, on the server today, which is Cray. That, that literally never, ever happened to me the entire time I've been playing. It's amazing. It is amazing. Okay, so it's time for us to make a portal. You can see I've made a sort of... Uh, a a semi-effort of making a plinth here. I kind of don't like it, and I kind of do, but we'll, we'll, we'll go with it for now. Now, I've got myself a middle of a structure here. Do we want to make it four wide, or do we want to make it two? Yeah, we'll, we'll make it this wide. Go off to the sides there. Is that enough internal space? That is. That's a beautiful. Let's just... Oh, no. Oh, of course, I've made big errors here. Thankfully, not such a big error when you have vein mining on the go, so that's pretty good. Let's uh, drop those in there so I can actually just fill it in. I suppose technically we didn't need to fill those side ones in there, but I'm definitely going to do so up above here. So we've got the four wide there. I suppose we only need to go so high, but I'm going to go uh, one, more, one more. Why not? I've, I've got the obsidian. There is no reason for me not to. Oh, this is, this is going to hurt. Ah! Okay, that's cool. That's fine. Who, who cares? Who cares? A few hearts are not the end of the world. Mm, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, let's do it. Slam. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Uh, now, if we just pop that in there. Right. I should have my flint and steel, and this is a classic way. Okay, now I'm expecting to be teleported to the middle of nowhere. So I am going to open this up. Well, I say the middle of nowhere. I'm expecting to be teleported to someone else's 945 someone else's portal so i want to get my position here 70 33 nice so that i can do some divide by eights and figure out exactly where i'm supposed to be but wish me luck guys i've been told that the chances of me dying the moment i turn up are quite high do i want to get rid of stuff out of my inventory that might be an idea let's see let's just uh, here, I, let, I want those, and these, the obsidian. Let's just drop some dirt. I don't care about that. Okay. In fact, let's take a stack of dirt. You never know if that, like, some blocks are going to be useful. All right. Here we go. Whew, wish me luck. 
Let's go through and see what we get. Of course, we are looking uh, for quartz. That is, that is the only thing we are looking for is quartz. Uh, I've got a feeling the moment I go through... Uh, should I immediately turn around and go back? I don't know. I don't know. We need to go deeper. Okay, it's achieved. Jump quickly just to make sure that I am completely synced up. So, yeah, obviously, this is not my portal. Uh, I'm not sure where my portal is going to be, but I will use it for now. I will use it for now. Let's have a quick look out and around. That looks a little bit deadly. There's a, a cow over there. Oh! Didn't even see him. Didn't even see him. <laughs> Lol. Thankfully, I didn't go anywhere, but... um ouch <laughs> well that was fun let's go and see if we can get my stuff back i, I don't know I, I don't know i'm just gonna die and die and die over again it's it's a possibility it's a possibility the fact that it took a while for him to attack me might mean that he's not just here uh let's let's run away as soon as i can just get round stuff break lines of sight do whatever i can to make this a little bit better okay cool all right, let's let's see what I can do here. Uh, I, I need a better crouch button. I don't I don't see the thing that got me. Am I breaking this fine? All right, jump up and grab all the stuff quick. Jump back down. Uh, shield up. No, that's that's not my shield. That's uh, okay. Problem with the yo-yo and the oh, I need my chisel as well. Don't hurt me, please. Okay, that seems to be working out okay. I hear a gasp. That's not. That's not great. I. I don't care if my stuff dropped down over the side. I mean, do I? What's. What's down under here? Okay. I'm just gonna take a quick look. Oh, I kind of care about that. Okay. There's a hole right there, and then my pickaxe. Let's go see if we can work with that. Is that hole this hole? I don't know. Let's try going up here. Um, it's a block. That's fine. I'm not loving the fact that I'm so exposed. Let's do something like that. I'm just going to kind of creep across. I hear something being scary out there. Let's just fill this hole in. I believe this is the hole that I was seeing. So that should mean if I just kind of dig up here and jump. Yeah, that was my pickaxe. Nice. All right. Quality. That, that's it. Jo job, job achieved. Actually, that's not job achieved. We now need to try and find some nether quartz. Man, this this is going to be tough. Let's get an overview up top to see what we can see. Someone's been dropping some stuff there. Let, can we see anything? Pigman up there. Cyber... Ooh, the explodey creeper guy there. That, that, that's cool, though. That's cool. This place is just full of stuff. It's so cool. It's so cool. All right, it looks like I'm going... Uh, I'm going mining, guys. It looks like I am going mining. Nether quartz ore. Okay, this is what we're looking for. It's taking a while to get here, but let's pop it all out. Is that nether diamond ore as well? No! Run away! Run away! That's a thing that's going to kill me. Got, got to be gone. Why isn't it taking damage? Okay, that's pretty good. Let's get it again. Come on, take damage. Why isn't it taking damage? Uh, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't have anything else to beat it with either. Uh, let's just fill that in like that. Okay, that's that's gonna be fine, right? What? Why would that not be fine? I don't even know. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Did I get? Did I get some? I got 15. All right, that's good. That is what I am here for. Literally, that is what I'm here for. I'm, I'm, I'm getting out of here. I, I I'm scared. I may have destroyed someone's base. I'm not even gonna appear in someone's base here. This is going to be somewhere else. Alright, let's find out where we are. Uh, I'm not going to appear, sorry, in my base. I'm going to appear in someone else's base. Cool. Maybe with Pigman. Who knows? Who knows? Oh, man. Where where am I? Where am I? Seriously? This is the place you've brought me to? Now, I've been here before. I know I have been here before. But... The <clears throat> Might not be my portal, but if this isn't even in someone's base or anything like that. I just, I'm just gonna get rid of it. I'm just gonna get rid of it. Oh man! <laughs> oh, I was about to say someone has really gone to town here protecting themselves, but it turns out it is for a very, very good reason. Oh, how do I, how do I get out of here without getting mobbed myself? I'm gonna try and escape if I can. Literally just dig up and out. I don't even know if it's daytime or what. What level am I on? I'm currently on 
37. I want to turn around and put some blocks in my way here. Thanks, brilliant. Uh, so I've been wandering around wherever it was that we were just a second ago uh, and trying to find my way out. That, that way's home. But as you can see, I'm actually like a kilometer away. So whatever happened with the portal linkage, like that, it was very much not linking you know it was distance away uh, so far away and the place was so scary that I didn't want to try and find the right place to put my portal down I need some armor basically that that's what it breaks down to is I need a serious armor but thankfully on the way I'm getting all this iron as well Pwah, lovely Hmm, so I followed the staircase up. I actually uh, ended up having to dig my way out, came up inside one of the like these water pocket areas here, uh, and found this. I wonder whose base this is. I, I don't know. I do not know. There is a... What is this system over here? Let's, let's go and have a look. Redstone is being used. I am intrigued. Is it just a door opening system? It appears to be just a door opening system. Okay, well, that, that, that's cool. That's cool. All right, anyway, I got, I got to get back home. Home. Home is over this way. I'm looking at my map and I'm wondering whether we can boat it all the way over there. That would be pretty good. Let's just get three of these. I like traveling by boat. I think it's one of the more uh, underutilized forms of transport in Minecraft in minecraft uh you know what i'm just gonna leave that there that's fine someone else can have a block of wood with that okay cool leave that there like that brilliant so someone will appreciate that one day they'll be like oh i really need to make something or something or other and they'll find that and it'll be like yay thank you random internet person who left that there and i'll be like you're welcome uh anyway with that little tangent let's try and find a way a back shall we i've got a feeling i'm gonna end up going through the swampland here try and make my way through here maybe jump over there yeah i mean i know that's actually quite a distance but that that would be cool if we could do that let, let yeah let's let's give it a go All right, made it back home. Took a little while, but there we go. Did it. Bam. Uh, what, not, not the button I was looking for. This is the button I'm looking for. Okay, awesome. So we got ourselves some nether quartz. Now, I think, man, that my area is getting massively overgrown. Going to have to do something about that. But I think it's time that we built ourselves a, a few a simple machines. I am going to need to first build myself some way of storing all this nether stuff. Because, man, there is a lot of it. I've sorted a few of my things out here, made a few temporary arrangements for storing stuff. Let's make a few, uh, let's make this peat farmer, really. That's, that's kind of the thing I am here to do right now. I only want the one. Thanks, though. That's very nice of you to offer such as that. Where did I put the rest of the things that I was going to take? Oh, I know where I put them. All the way over by the portal. Man, I've, I've got to work on this uh, this remembering things issue. It's it's a tough one. I'll go and put things somewhere, and then I'll, I'll think that I've got them in my inventory, and I'll go to do the thing that I was going to do, and oh, no, no, I actually put them over there here because I needed to do a dangerous thing. Uh, now, uh, talking of dangerous thing, am I going to get, like pigmen sport spewing forth from there and are they going to be dangerous normally no they're not but who knows with this mod pack anything could be going down block place okay that's cool uh shall we is, is he still in there we got to deal with him at some point we've got to deal with him at some point especially as i want to make one of these sides my farm my peat farming area it's probably gonna have to be sooner rather than later we got everything for that biggity bam peat farmer is now a done okay i'm looking at him i'm looking at the yo-yo in my hand here i wonder if i could go over the top of the block is is that possible is that possible let's find out there's also something just round the back here no, I don't see whatever this is supposed to be on my map. All right, I'm going to assume that we're good. I'm going to assume that we're... What happened over there? What? What happened? What? Hey? <laughs> this is new. This is new. Okay, we'll, we'll bear that in mind. I'll have a quick word with the cypher at some point to see if that was, that was him. 
Uh, can we go down this way? No, no, we can't. Okay, so the way that I'm going to deal with this, I'm going to take out the floor. Uh, can I can I see him anywhere in there? There he is. Beautiful, beautiful. Why wouldn't that be enough? Okay, cool. That that's damage happening. I was just wondering what all the the yeah those sort of prof, prof noises are. But uh, that that do what? Actual what? What what was that? I, I was not aware that anything would blow up with such ferocity. More to the point, I didn't see anything creeping up on me. There was that big hole. I was worried about that big hole. Maybe that I was worried for a specific reason. Wow, what what did the damage? I am... I am oh, invisible charged creepers? Question mark? I'm not sure. What do I even do about that? What do I even do about it? Is, is he floating? Where's, where's my grave marker? That's what I'm looking for right now, is my grave marker. Gosh, look at all this. Just actually look at it all. What do we do about him? I, I, I can't even get my... Where's my grave? Staring at him, being like, hmm... Let's grab a few items here. Maybe uh, fill in this hole here. Just so it's a little bit more secure. I mean, I could even go down that way, but I think we're alright with that. I mean, like, is, it, is that my grave? Or is that something that's going to blow up? I, mean, I don't know at this point. How do I even check? How do I even check? Getting a lot of interesting things out and about and around. I don't know. That, 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 that probably is. That's probably it. Okay, let's, uh, let's collect up a whole bunch of stuff here. Man, look at this place. What are we even going to do with it? What are we even going to do? Uh, let's just start filling some holes in. I need, I need a chest <laughs> badly. Let's go. Let's go and uh, put some stuff in the chest. Salvage cyber, cyber eyes. I wonder what that's about. Press uh, immunity to blindness uh, enables cyber eye upgrade. Requires one power when in use. All right, I'm not sure what that's for, but does that indicate what actually killed me? Uh, I'm hoping so. Actually, I need a few dirt blocks here. Man, this is uh, this is going to be a tidy up job. I, I'm not even sure if I've got the stuff to tidy up this with. Uh, but I, I'm after my my yo-yo, so I can deal with that that Dalek over there. Wow, just just look still. I mean, I I know I've been exclaiming for a few seconds now, but this is wow, just wow. Okay. Yeah, it's a gravestone. It's a gravestone. It says I need a pickaxe for it, but I'm fairly sure I can just put, break it like this. Okay, that's all my stuff. All right, that's good. Whoa. That's 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 kind of the thing that I was scared of there. Let's just uh, go around and pick up a load of this dirt. Uh, it's so much dirt, it's just not not really funny. Uh, that that can stay there. Whatever. The wall of amazingness. What are we gonna do to fill this up? Like, honestly, obviously this has happened to someone else. What even got me? All right, I think we're just gonna do one last thing before we finish up here. Can I throw them all the way over there? I can. I'm gonna see if I can do double a biomass. I don't know if this is actually a thing or not. It is. Okay, awesome. Uh, that's eight. That that's fine. That's only two slots there, but we all shall uh, live with that. Now, also somewhere over here. Ah. Ah, there is definitely a thing I'm missing. I, I need to go and find the peat bog that we had. Do you remember we cooked up a whole bunch somewhere? Um, unfortunately, I am not good at keeping my place well organized. Uh, we're we're going to have to make an entire draw room in there. In fact, that is what that room is for, is uh, storage and basic crafting. So uh, but that, that, that one, that's the one I'm talking of. Oh, and of course, it's nearly... Where, where's my day entrance? There is. Of course, it's nearly a night time as well. All right, ran around a little bit and got myself this uh, soaked peat. Let's just put it straight in there and that'll cook off and go down to the bottom. The, uh, the the aim today, the aim just to wrap up this episode here, is to try and get the peat fire generator and the peat farmer down. These should be relatively easy to do. Uh, I want to kind of do this, grab my biomass and go up and around like that. Now, I don't know if there is a, an automatic way of doing this particular process, getting the biomass and turning the dirt into peat bog. I hope there is. I really do hope there is because there are definitely uh, that's definitely an area that could do with a fair bit of automation. That would be great. But anyway, this this big hole here, I think I'm going to make it my peat farm. I, I think that's probably a good shout there. Let's come across here. We go one, two, three, four. 
Yep, counting with Twitchy, it's what it's all about. Five, six. Should we go seven and eight? I think that's seven and then an eighth. Uh, I'm actually going to put this in the floor like that. I think that's probably the best way of uh, doing this. Probably open this all up. Don't do not do it like that. This is how you get bad guys on you. Uh, like this, that should work out pretty well for me. I don't, I don't really want things up at this level. Not to begin with. There goes my shovel. All right, that's cool. Uh, I also want to put one of these right next to it. Ba -ba -ba Biggity bam with the words I was trying to go for there. Let's put some peat bog in there. And of course, I've also got this water bucket that I want to go clonk. Uh, shall we steal some more water from over here? Man, I've got to do something about the number of hearts I have on the go. Uh, I believe there is actually a quest for that. We'll probably give it a good old look at some point. Look at these recessed bottoms here. Was not aware that that was a thing. I'm hoping that the fact that I can take water from here repeatedly means that it is an infinite source for me. Okay, that's pretty good. Next thing I want is the peak. Oh, I've just noticed there's a red dot on my radar back there. I don't... I don't want to have the possibility of dying. Uh, let, let's go see where this thing is. It's down. It says it's down. Okay, so it's in a cave system underneath here. I, I, I'm obviously, and I think legitimately, a little bit scared of all the things that can kick off around here. Is there something down here? Oh, man, I, th this is a bad idea. We all know this is a bad idea, right? Is that a hole there? No. Okay, all right. Hi, hi there, horses. What's going on? I think we'll be okay. What is that thing? What is that? Is that going to kill me in one go? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, it's a Doctor Who mob. Um, I, I should remember what that is. If I'm to be honest with you, I should. But I don't. Can I, uh, can I get my yo-yo back, please? Thanks. Got some clockwork bits. And what is that? A salvaged ender convergence unit. Okay, that's a thing. I'm not sure if I said the right words at the end there. But that's pretty good. Man, look at these holes. Just look at these holes. Definitely need to come and fill them all in. But that's the end of the immediate problems. Garlic up there is super scary, super scary. I'm not sure if I can face down a garlic, a uh, garlic. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can face down a garlic, you know. Uh, I'm not sure if I can face down a Dalek with the equipment that I've got, unfortunately. That wasn't where I wanted to be. Right in there. All right, cool. So we get a bunch of, gen of uh, power generating here. You can see that we've got 5.6 point loads of RF there. And hopefully it's coming along and powering this one up. That's pretty good. And then I need to turn this over to always on. And look, stuff's going out. Is that it? That's, that, that's, that, oh, disappointing. But there we go. That should now start putting down a, a framework around here. What it's going to do is put these around the outside. Then it's going to have another ring two in and then put water in between so that it can turn into peat. Uh, the, the stuff that we farm. Okay, so can I turn this on and off? Is that a thing? Uh, I've got some redstone here. Let's... <gasps> it's placing water. It's placing water. Let's just make one of these torches and see if I can actually turn it on and off. Uh, that That's good, though. That's that's almost exactly what I want. That's almost exactly what I want. Let's put that there. If I do that, is this turned off? I can't access it now, so maybe. Okay, there we go. No, this does not turn it off. That's um, actually a little bit of a shame. But I think with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time. We're going to get a whole bunch of these other basic machines up and running. Hopefully figure out how to make this an entirely, entirely automatic process. And maybe, just maybe, start putting some torches down so we can make this place safe. But I will see you then. Oh, and we're going to do that. Bye! My space bar is so loud.